right, this is what we're starting with. This is the roof. All the paint's peeling. Right there. Everything else is good. This whole side right here, this little spot, that spot, that spot. Got the hood off. Grenade ripped the entire hood, and just all feathered out, and then high build it. All right, I stripped the hood, 80 grit. That's about four coats of high build. And we're gonna do the roof next. Um, get the rug luggage racks off and do them spots down the side. Got the Tahoe stripped down. See this side's in really good shape. No flaking paint on this side. I got three small dings in the door I gotta fix. I got all the glue off the moldings. Back bumper off. I got the roof stripped pretty much down to the bare metal. I gotta work on this. It's the only flaking on this side. And this side sat out in the sun. This is the side that sat in the sun. What I did is I pressure washed it with my 4,000 PSI pressure washer and a pinpoint, pinpoint nozzle and sprayed and flaked as much of the paint off as I could and then sanded back from the flake down to here to get good paint. This paint's hard as a rock. I gotta do the top of that yet. I got the, this door done, this door done, all around the top. And this fender had some checking. Well, this had some checking right here. So I stripped this whole thing and this had some checking right in here and right across the top of this fender so I just blasted it all the way down to there that way i know i got some good paint then i'll high build everything probably day after tomorrow and uh go from there got all the windows out all the moldings out mirrors door handles i mean i'll be ready to paint it this weekend Ready to put some high build on it. I'm gonna do the roof. And both of these doors and fenders. And then we will come back. Alright, I got it all bagged, sanded, taped up, inner fenders out. is outside all 90% put together I don't have the running boards back on it yet but it's uh, all back together pretty smooth pretty flat a couple little pieces of dust in it but it's not even worth uh, what sand and buffing for. There it is. Next is the interior. It's nasty. Got to pull all the carpet out and shampoo it and pressure wash it. And 
and we'll be done.